What music is that I hear? Something to try and make you feel at home. <laughs> Today is going to be quite an interesting day because we are talking about the dark side. Have you ever looked at a screen in the night time and realized that the white is too white for you? Well, many software computers or the phone, they have this yellow filter on the software, you know. So, it's called light shift some places, it's called night mode some places and it reduces the strain in your eyes. But what if any of your apps are actually grey or black? More and more phones have AMOLED screens now. Uh, what that means is just when the screen wants to display black, it turns off the pixel entirely. So the black is really black. And many phone companies have made the switch onto AMOLED, including the new iPhone 10. So that means that the apps can really use the black mode and make it look awesome. So in LCD screens, what happens is each pixel tries to display a black color when the screen is trying to show a black image. So it ends up emitting a color which is kind of gray because it's trying to show a black color. If you don't know what uh, I'm talking about when I say pixels and so on, I made a video about that. So that will probably help you understand what pixels are and how they function. So uh, click on this link right here in the left somewhere over here and uh, it'll take you to my pixel video. Back to our dark mode. So this technology was invented by Samsung and uh, along with LG they represent the majority sales of AMOLED screens. So almost all phones now have AMOLED screens with some exceptions like Apple was taking to LCD until recently when they switched on to AMOLED and now so many phones have AMOLED screens. That begs the question to popular app makers like YouTube or a, an app that you spend too much time looking at like a reading app like Kindle or iBooks that begs the popular question why not have a dark mode where the screen is all black so all the pixels are off many popular software have gone this way like the new Mac OS which is called Mojave the J is like in Mojito um, I discovered that the uh, embarrassing way but Mojave now has a black theme and now that means that most of the backgrounds menus are all black uh, or gray um, the new iPhone OS iOS is also having a black theme Android moved this way a long time ago although this was Samsung who wanted to show off how awesome their screen was many sc phone manufacturers are now switching into that like I'm using the OnePlus 5T it has a black theme uh, not just the app drawer, everything from the settings to now even important apps like like I just mentioned YouTube they have this really black theme which is not straining at all. Let's just dive into the computer. I'll talk about YouTube first so let's just go to youtube.com and um, then if you just hit your icon up here, damn it's so getting so hot. If you clicked your icon right here and went to dark theme right there and hit on that makes everything else nice and black in the back and uh, although i'm using this on an lcd screen it is really awesome so my default browser is google chrome and i'll show you how i got the black theme on that if you open chrome and went to menu then settings and um, hit themes there is a dark theme right here material incognito dark that's what it's called here. Just hit add to Chrome and uh, there you've got it. A black Chrome theme. Almost everyone's going this way. If you remember the Windows XP back in the day, they used to run a really blue toolbar. Hang on, let me just show you this. I have a Windows PC here. And if you look at it, uh, the toolbar in the Windows new Windows 10 is now black. And if you went to the menus and stuff, you can choose the accent color here, by the way. But um, all of that is so dark, you know. Um, Windows also works on many tablets nowadays and several tablets are having this uh, AMOLED screens like we just spoke about a short while ago. So many guys are going black. So maybe you don't know about this, maybe you already do. That's my video for today. 
I don't know if that was helpful, but now you know that your phone and computer and software, your interface can be black, you know, now you know. Thank you so much for watching, take care of yourself, share this with someone who needs a black theme in their life to switch over to the dark side, <laughs> take care of yourself and keep learning. While you're there, if you like that video, then please tell me that you did. It uh, encourages me and motivates me to do more of these videos. If you haven't already subscribed, then subscribe to my channel and hit the bell. That way, the next time I put up a video, you get a notification. You're already learning, so take care of yourself. I'll see you next week. Goodbye, this time for real though. <laughs> Bye.